I'm Rachel. Welcome to Slow Fashion Mom. Today I wanted to share with you my video on decluttering my kids' clothing and closets. About six months ago I read the book The Magical Art of Tidying Up by Marie Kondo and at that point I decluttered and organized my closet and bedroom and I have to say I absolutely love the results. Just looking at my closet and my organized clothing brings me a sense of peace and calm. And surprisingly, it hasn't been any work to maintain. In the past, when I've decluttered and organized, it always becomes a mess again after, you know, a few weeks, a month, but our closet has stayed the way it is. And I really want to try this with my kids' room. Basically, they have a ridiculous amount of clothing and it's driving me crazy you know my wardrobe is a minimal capsule wardrobe so I don't know how they accumulated so many clothing I think they receive a lot of clothes as gifts and also hand-me-downs and I guess I've just been really bad at I just accept everything I don't sort it out when we receive it pass it on or whatever so their closet and their drawers are a mess and I can't wait to tackle that. For those that are familiar with the magical art of tidying up and the KonMari method, basically it's it's a little complicated. I just kind of, I'm not following it to a T. I chose what I liked and applied it to my closet and it's really working for me so basically getting rid of things you don't love and you don't wear and then she has a cool little system of folding clothing so they stack upright so you can see when you open a drawer you can see what's there easily i'm going to show you some before and after footage of my tidying and decluttering here we go i just wanted to give you a quick look at my kids clothing before I begin my decluttering. My kids share a room, my son's stuff on the left here, and he has a ridiculous amount of shirts. He's also got quite a few pairs of pants, and my daughter's on the right. Wow, her, her side's a disaster. So onesies and socks are in this drawer. Her pants and her shirts are in here, and these are her pajamas. They have more clothes in their closet even, mainly sweaters and clothes they're not wearing right now. Um, some dresses and long sleeve shirts. There's the before. I'm ready to get to work now, and I will be back to show you the after. Hello, welcome back. It's been two days since my before video and I have finally finished decluttering my kids' wardrobe. This is my son. These are t-shirts, long sleeve t-shirts and sweaters. There's a couple sweaters in the wash. And this, these are shorts and pants, but the shorts are all being repaired. So the middle portion will be shorts for my daughter. We have slippers, socks, tights, and the onesies in this drawer. Pants, shorts, and shirts in here. Pajamas and sweaters down here. And as for the closet, dresses and skirts for my daughter and <laughs> for my son, two lone button-up shirts. <laughs> And as you can see, I could completely remove the hanging storage. I was shocked that they had so many clothes. And once I got rid of stuff we weren't using, I didn't need that at all. I am very happy with the after. It took me about two days of work, not constantly, but you know, I had to work in the decluttering around nap time and bedtime and life. So I could do a bit here and there and after two days, that's what I was left with. I do have to say I was absolutely shocked with the amount of clothing my children had. My son alone had 18 t-shirts, which, you know, I think is completely unnecessary. 
but he can't even, he doesn't even wear half of them. Basically what I did with the clothes was I kept what we're wearing now for spring and summer and I have a huge bag of clothing that I packed away that I think will fit them in the fall and winter next year and I was left with one bag of clothes that my daughter's outgrown that were in good condition that I can hopefully sell and one bag that my son has outgrown which I can pass to a friend. This was my experience decluttering and organizing my kids closet. I'm hopeful that it will stay this way. The only kind of wrench in the plan is that my daughter loves to pull clothing out of the drawers and also my son is quite messy when he's choosing his clothes for school. So anyways, we will see how that goes. If you have experienced decluttering or organizing your kids room, I would love to hear what you've done or if you've got any other tips that would be great. I would love to hear them. So thanks so much for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.